Hey guys, it's Sailor Drew, and today I wanted to talk to you about this absolutely charming little game called Stardew Valley. So if you haven't played it yourself, you may have heard of it as it's been released on several different platforms, and most recently it has come to the Nintendo Switch, which is pretty exciting, and I've seen a lot of people say that they just picked it up for the first time on the Switch. So Stardew Valley is an indie game and it is amazing. I highly recommend it, especially if you like farming sim games like Harvest Moon or even Animal Crossing. But it's so much more than that. Yes, you do run around and do the occasional errand for your super kooky neighbors in the town, but Every single character is very unique in their own sense. They feel real and fleshed out, have real loves, desires, fears, their own likes and dislikes even. So um, I will admit that the first year that I played this game, everyone in my town hated me because I was giving them the wrong things. But that's something that we'll explore more in my series once it launches. Beyond acting like a good neighbor and maybe starting up some in-town romance between yourself and one of the many single people there. There's a bit of action and adventure in this game, a lot of chance for exploration, and some crazy magical side quests as well, as we do have our own in-town resident who is a wizard, um, whose ex-wife I guess is a witch, that you may or may not encounter as you play the game. So we have a lot of opportunity for adventure, romance, and of course, math. Recently, a lot of buzz has come out about the game as well, beyond just coming out on the Nintendo Switch, in that we got a lot of new content for the game, including multiplayer. And while I won't be concentrating on multiplayer, I will be checking out a lot of the new content for the very first time, so hopefully some of that will be new to you guys as well. Now I'm sure all of this sounds great to you guys, but why is it that I've crossed out the star on a lot of the promotional art that I've released talking about this game leading up to the live episode tomorrow, but basically I have ultra modded this game to be something that is more like super dainty and ultra cute. So I hope that you guys enjoy a lot of the changes that I've made um, because it's this game is beautiful and fantastic and one of the absolute best game soundtracks that I've ever heard of. Um, but I like to mod games after a certain point of enjoyment in the game and it's something that I'm hoping that enhances the game and makes it fresh and new to you guys who have played the game and are a bit of um, a savant as far as this game is concerned. So I hope you'll join me as we rehab this old dusty farm, find some love, and make a home for ourselves in this tiny little sleepy town. The first episode of this Let's Play series is going to be live on June 3rd at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, so I really hope to see you there. Also, let me know in the comments down below if this will be your first experience with the game or if you're a bit of a Stardew Savant yourselves. Subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell to be part of the notification squad and to be alerted whenever I go live. And I hope to see you guys tomorrow, but until then, take care. Man, I should have thought to name this series Star Drew Valley. <laughs> oh well.